is all right, but police have no suspects in custody. Back from D.C., three mayors from southeastern Wisconsin were among the nearly 300 mayors in the nation's capital all week. The main topic of discussion, how to prevent another mass shooting. As A.J. Byatpour reports, it's an issue all too familiar for the local contingent. Searching for the right mix. In a Racine coffee shop, Mayor John Dickert says about 280 mayors discussed the different ingredients needed to put together a solution to gun violence. The time for talk is over. Uh, we have to start working on this issue. We have to start looking at the issues of, of background checks. That specific issue resonates with Brookfield Mayor Stephen Ponto. In October, Radcliffe Houghton shot three women to death and wounded four others at the Azana Salon and Spa. He was specifically ordered not to have a gun, but bought one through a private online sale. So that wasn't subject to a background check. You know, I think most of us would want to have people have some kind of criminal background check uh, before they, you know, go ahead and acquire a gun. Although Ponto says that's a good start, he's quick to say the discussion in D.C. should have been broader. There was some mention, but the focus should also have been on mental health issues, mental health commitment procedures, and I think the focus should have been on uh, violence in entertainment. Dickert says there's no simple solution, but believes the conference was a success. What you found in that 280 or so mayors that came together was really a coordination and a commitment to this issue. Both mayors hope that coordination leads to real change back home. AJ Bipor, Fox 6 News. Oak Creek Mayor Stephen Scafidi was also at that conference. Those meetings focus on other topics as well, including economic development and ways to improve the country's transportation infrastructure. Operation Drive Sober continues this weekend. Milwaukee County.